हेलो एवरीवन आई एम योर होस्ट आयुषी कारा सेठिया एंड वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल पैबली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ यू कैन ऐड कॉन्टैक्ट्स टू गो हाई लेवल वाया फ्लूएंट फॉर्म सबमिशंस ऑटोमेटिकली सो फर्स्ट लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट दीस सॉफ्टवेयर एप्लीकेशंस आर ऑल अबाउट सो फ्लूएंट फॉर्म्स इज अ फॉर्म बिल्डिंग सॉफ्टवेयर एप्लीकेशन एंड इट इज अ प्लगइन ऑफ वर्डप्रेस एंड हाई लेवल और गो हाई लेवल इज अ सीआरएम सॉफ्टवेयर एप्लीकेशन so the idea here is that you have created a subscriber form using your fluent forms account and you have embedded that form on a website to get the form filled now you want that whenever any of your customer fills that subscriber form automatically using the details of the form submission a new contact should get created into your go high level crm account so that a customer database can be created and you can use those databases for your business related activities For this, we need to create a connection between Fluent Forms and Go High Level CRM. So, in order to create a connection, we are going to use a software application named Pabli Connect. So, basically, Pabli Connect is an automation and integration software which will help us in integrating Fluent Forms with Go High Level CRM automatically. The best part here is it doesn't require any coding skills or programming knowledge. Even a non-technical person can use this software application very easily. So in this particular integration we are using fluent forms for creating the forms so in place of fluent forms you can also use contact form 7 google forms jot forms or any other form building software application and in place of go high level we can also use insightly crm hubspot crm zoho crm or any other crm software application so let us learn the integration process now on my screen so welcome back to my screen Here let us type p a b b l y pabli dot com in our browser. This is the website of Pabli. Here we have to come to products and click on Pabli Connect. This is the landing page of Pabli Connect. As you are the first time user, you have to click on sign up for free option, and you can create your own account in just two minutes. And you are going to get hundred task free every month. As I already have an account with Pabli Connect. I'll simply click on sign in. In the all apps section, come to Pabli Connect and click on access now. This is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here we have to create a workflow. For that, come to this plus sign and click on create workflow. Now here we have to give a name to the workflow. So let us give the name as Fluent Forms to Go High Level Integration. Here you can give the workflow name as per your requirement and simply click on create. Now we can see a trigger window and an action window. So Pabli Connect works on the concept of trigger and action. Trigger means when this happens, action means do this. So in this use case, we want to add a contact to Go High Level CRM account on Fluent Form submission. So open this trigger window, choose the application name as Fluent Forms. Select the trigger event as New Form submission. Now here we can see a webhook URL and some instructions. So by following these instructions, you can set up the webhook in your Fluent Forms specific form. So I'll just copy this webhook URL from here, and I'll just take you to my WordPress account. So this is my WordPress dashboard. Here we can find the Fluent Forms option. But if you can't find it, you have to just install the plugin from your WordPress account. And here, let us move to the Fluent Forms option, and I'm just going to open the forms over here, which I have already created in my Fluent Forms account. and i have created some subscriber form integration request form report issue form and some other forms so we are going to access this subscriber form for this particular integration so i'm just going to open the form for you here in this form i have taken the basic fields of the customer that is the first name last name email address if you want to add some more fields from here you can select the fields and you can add it to the form and once you have created the form simply save the form from here and here we can find the form link So you can use this particular link, the short link, to embed the form on a website. So I have already used this link, and I have embedded it on the WordPress web page over here. Okay, the subscriber form. So we will be accessing the form after some time. First, let us create an integration between this particular form and Pabli Connect, so that whenever the form is filled by the customer, automatically the details are captured in Pabli Connect. For that, scroll down, and here we can find the settings option. Click on settings and click on WP Webhooks. and here we have to just click on send data 
and here we have to select the available webhook triggers. So let's scroll down. Okay, and here we have to just come to Fluent Forms option and click on Form Submitted. Okay, and now we are going to just add the webhook URL over here by clicking on this Add Webhook URL button. Here we have to give a name to the webhook. So let us give it as Go High Level Integration. Here we have to paste the webhook URL which we have copied from Pabli Connect. And let's click on Add for Fluent Forms Submitted. Okay, and let's scroll down and at last we can see that our webhook is saved over here. Now we have to just click on the three dots and click on the settings option. Here we have to select the action settings for Go High Level Integration webhook. Now here we have to select the form trigger on the selected form. So our form is subscriber form. So we have to select my form name. Select only the forms you want to fire the trigger on. You can also choose multiple ones. If none is selected, all are triggered. So I have selected my form name from here. And let's click on save settings. Okay, now the settings are saved. Let's close this window. Okay, let's move back to Public Connect. And here we can see that it is waiting for the webhook response. So in order to capture the response, we have to do a test submission. It means we have to fill up the form on the name of a customer. So let's move to the form and let us fill in the details over here. First name as Shikha, last name as Gupta. Email address as Shikha Gupta 11 at the rate gmail.com. And let's click on submit form. Thank you for your message. We will get in touch with you shortly. Okay, so the form has been filled. Now let's move back to Public Connect. Okay, and here we can see the responses received and all the details of the customer through the form submission are captured over here. First name as Shikha, last name as Gupta and the email address. Okay, so I have missed an A over here in the Gupta. So it is uh, Shikha Gupta now. Okay, no issues. Now we want that using these details of the customer, automatically a new contact should get added to your Go High Level account. For that, come to this action step. Choose the application name as High Level or Go High Level. Select the action event as Create Contact. Click on Connect. Click on add new connection. Now it is asking for the token. To get the location API key bearer token, log into your Go High Level account. Go to the settings, company and API key. Okay. So I'll just take you to my Go High Level account. So this is my agency dashboard. Here we have to just scroll down, come to the settings option. And here we can find the API keys. Simply click on it. And here we can find all the agency API keys and the location API keys. So now I want to create a contact in my location named Arya Associates. So I'm just going to copy this API key from here and I'll be pasting the same API key over here in Mably Connect. And let's click on save. Okay, now the Go High Level CRM account is connected. Now here we have to give the first name, last name and other details of the customer which we have already got from the form submission over here, the fluent form submission. So we will be mapping all these details now. Okay, let us map them one by one. First, we have to map the first name from fluent forms and the first name was Shikha. After that, let us map the last name that was Gupta. Here we have to map the full name. So let us map them all together. That is Shikha as well as Gupta. Okay, I'll just give a space in between. Okay, and here we have to map the email address. Okay, so we don't have the phone details, so I'm just leaving it as blank. Even we don't have the address details, so I'm just leaving it as blank. If you're having any of, the de any of these details, you can just give it over here. And let's click on save and send test request. Okay, and here we can see the response is received. It means a new contact is added to our Go High Level account. Let's check it. Here we will be moving to the account that is Arya Associates. Let's scroll down, come to the contacts section and click on contacts smart list. Okay, and here we can see that Shikha Gupta is added as a new contact over here and here we can find her email address. So in this way, we can see that our integration is working fine. Let's move back to public connect and let us save this workflow first. Data saved successfully. Okay, 
Now, as we have created an automation between our Fluent Forms and Go High Level CRM account, next time whenever any of your customer is going to fill the form and uh, Public Connect is going to capture the response, automatically using the details of the form submission, a new contact will get added to your Go High Level CRM account. So, let us check this in the real time that whether our integration is actually working fine or not. So, let us move to the form once again and let us fill in the details. And uh, I'll just give the first name as Ayushi, last name as Jen, email address as Ayushi Jen 123 at the rate gmail.com. And let's click on submit form. Okay, the, uh, thank you for your message. We will get in touch with you shortly. So the form has been filled. Now we have to check whether the same contact is added to your Go High Level CRM account or not. We have to refresh this account. Okay, and here we can see that Ayushi Jan is added as a new contact over here. And here we can find her email address. So, in this way, we can see that our integration is perfectly working fine. Let's move back to Public Connect and I'll just minimize all these windows and let us see in a nutshell whatever we have done till now. Okay, so first we have created an integration between Fluent Forms and Public Connect. Then Public Connect has captured all the details of the customer through the form submission. And using those details of the customer, automatically a new contact was created into your Go High Level CRM account. And in this way, we have created a successful integration between Fluent Forms and Go High Level CRM using Pabli Connect. So not just these software applications, you can integrate a ton of applications and automate your business using Pabli Connect. In case of any queries, you can visit our Pabli forum. To check the pricing details of Pabli Connect, you can visit this particular URL. Also, the link of Pabli Connect and this workflow is available in the description box. You can clone the same workflow into your account directly. If you really like this video, please comment, share and subscribe. Thank you everyone.